Great, well, you've arrived on our construction side of the site, uh, and I thought a good way of doing this, seeing as we've been um, specialising in the construction for the last 30 years, is to bring up a few questions that we would like to ask you, or that you should consider when thinking about two-way radio. First one is, and it comes up every time, so what size is your site? You know, how big is it? Um, can you relate it to football pitches? Because obviously coverage varies, so we need to work that out. So that's a good one to have uh, ready to ask us. Um, have you already tried two-way radio across the site? Always helps us a lot. Um, if you have, it's great. If you haven't, we can always send you product to test out, uh, but that helps. Um, who's going to be using them? Is it going to be uh, security? Is it going to be main construction workers? Could it be crane to banksmen? Um, you know, they're very specialist areas. Uh, if you can help us with that one, that helps. Um, how many units will you be looking for? And this, this is quite relevant because it relates to some of the licensing, licensing elements and, um, and also the channel capacity. So, you know, if you've got 100 people on site or if you've got 10, depends how many channels you'll need. That's very useful. Um, will you be working from basements? Is the construction going to be needing to go underground? That's going to help us with the, the, the coverage uh, again. Um, how many floors are in the basement and how many floors are similar kind of thing? Very important point, will you be looking to rent or buy the equipment? I mean rental is a very popular way of doing it but uh, you may be wanting to move it to another site afterwards, in which case it may be better to purchase it. Either way, we'll give you the accurate figures and the best way of doing it. Um, is there some, somewhere high and central? Well, if, if we've got a larger site, maybe, I don't know, 10 football pitches possibly, if we put it into football pitch perspectives, then we need somewhere to put a booster station. Um, and quite often it's worth thinking about that before our site survey. Um, how noisy is the environment? Noisy environments you'll need accessories for. Uh, it may be they're not. Uh, it may be there's a health and safety element to the decibels. Uh, but we, we've got lots of things we can hook onto our equipment, lots of audio accessories that make it, that, that will um, actually make it bespoke for you. But these are, these are questions. So there's um, eight questions. And um, if you can think about those, then Give us a call. I'm sure we'll be able to sort you out and we're, we're, we're waiting for your call. So please give us a call. We've got a friendly professional team ready to help you out with your inquiries. Thanks very much for watching the video and we really look forward to being able to help you.